Welcome, I am Erwin and I am professional trading on BitMEX by using Sierra charts. I will show you how and today we are going to watch Bitcoin price action and market profile. BitMEX Coach is an educational platform and for education only. I learn people to trade Bitcoin on a professional way using the market profile and the footprint chart. Footprint is registered by Market Delta, so I will use the name Number Bars Chart. This is a charting technique that is commonly used in the traditional business, especially by bigger players like hedge funds and banks. I am personally active on the BitMEX exchange where I am trading the Bitcoin USD market. I am trading this using Sierra charts. This is a professional trading platform where I have imported the BitMEX API. Today I am going to show you how I take a short break entry in a downtrend using the market profile and the number bars chart to confirm this entry. Let's first have a look at the 4 hour setup on a candlestick chart. The yellow line acts as a support and it is under pressure. But the price bounced 3 times before meaning this is strong support. A professional trader is very cautious before taking an entry and follows a scheme to get a confirmed entry. How can we be sure that if the support breaks that it won't go against us in a short trade? The bad news is you can't be sure, as markets can change direction in a second due to news or other events. The good news is that there is a high probability setup that we can use to enter this trade and we are going to use this in our favor. Let's have a look at this setup on the 15 minute candlestick chart. You see nothing more than a few lines. These are representing 1. Our yellow 4 hour support line and 2. The developing market profile. The market profile as such is not a subject of this video, but in short it shows you the area where 70% of all trades took place. We call this the value area. The value area has a high, the value area high. It has a low, the value area low. And a POC. The POC is the point of control. This is the equilibrium where most trades took place. It's the price level where most buyers and sellers find each other to make trade. I use the developing market profile, meaning that the value area is trending with the market. The green arrow is where I put the short in. This is where the price candle shows a test of the value area low after falling under it. I take the short entry a few ticks under the 15 minute low of this candle. This is in fact a very commonly used strategy and the rejection of the value area low is mostly seen as the confirmation. A professional trader is more cautious and he wants more confirmation and therefore we are going to look at the number bars chart. The number bars chart shows us order flow and price action at each price level inside a candle and gives us a lot more information than a traditional candlestick. It would take us too far to explain the whole use of it, but let's look at our short trade to analyze it. The candles are numbered and below the candles you see the delta table, the total volume of the candle and the delta percentage. The delta is the amount of bought contracts minus the sold contracts. You see who is in control, the buyers or the sellers. When looking at candle number 1, we see the price penetrating the value area low and the price goes through the 4 hour support line but it is rejected at once. The numbers bar shows us very high selling of 3.2 million and 2 million contracts at the 57 and the 55 level but the price doesn't go lower and it set his low at 52. The market was at this point exhausted and there was no more downwards continuation. In candle 2 the price moved up back above the value area low and buyers entered the market. In the delta table we see that the percentage of sellers became less. Their share went from 53% to 41%. Candle 3 is very interesting as it is a green candle closing higher than it was opened but we see that the delta is in favor of the sellers. The sellers are back in control as their percentage is now 56%. 
We start to look for a short now. We are very interested as this is delta divergence, a green candle with negative delta. Candle 4 falls back on the value area low and penetrates it, but the equilibrium, the POC, the point of control of the candle itself, draw it as a yellow box here, is the value area low and the delta shows 62% of sellers. Candle 5 falls back under the value area low, the sellers are in control with 60%, but we still want to see more confirmation before entering. A traditional trader would make an entry when the price goes under the previous low, this would be in this case the 51 level. I like to look for another confirmation in the number bars. And my final confirmation is given by the huge sell volume and absorbed plus 4 million buy volume. All this information would not be available when you use only a classic candlestick and volume chart. That's why it is recommended to use the number bars chart to watch the order flow and the market profile for the setups. The combination of these two charting types are the most powerful tool I know to trade. Please feel free to contact me. We are offering lessons, chart books, live trading lessons, bitmax calls, mental and personal coaching and much more. The info to join us is in the description of this video. Thank you for watching. Let me know if there is anything else I can do for you. I am happy to help and please give this video a like.